Hello everyone, this is BCS Buster and welcome back to Let's Play New Horizons. Last time we found Zhao, but we let him go because he's apparently trying to save the, uh, the town of Maswell from the Turks. Okay, let me get Ahmed to stay on my team here. Sure, we'll give him a raise, why not? And now, we are going to help Zhao win this battle so that we can extract our revenge on him and make sure that he doesn't get defeated by the Turkish fleets. Um, if you hear some fudding in the, back, in the background, viewers, I apologize. Um, they're doing some renovations on my apartment. I'll talk more about that here when I have some time. But anyways, here's the entire Turkish Navy. And I'll uh, talk about that. Okay, there's Pili Reyes. We don't want to battle him. He's pretty strong. And he could defeat us because he's at a battle level of 50. There's Siddharth Kevin. We beat him already. Okay, there's Khalil Asha. He's got a feat of 10, um, 10 x -bex, And that he's a guy that the game's created for us. So um, we're going to take him out. That'll probably be a... He's a good choice. Now we just simply wait for him to show up, and um, I'm going to attack him, and we're going to take him out. He Again, he got, game created him, so here we go. There's only one fleet that's not a Turkish one. It's a Portuguese ship. Hey, it's Jows. It's coming toward us. Man, he must want to fight us after all. Let's see. We're taking so long, we thought we'd help him get it over with. Yeah. That's right. We're going to make sure that we take him out ourselves. And we're apparently giving, giving him orders. Fair enough. We'll just take out this guy right here. Okay. Oh, they set me up in horrible position. That's all right. He had, his fleet is 10 x so they really can't do too much damage to us. Yeah, sure. Take a shot at him. Why not? Ooh, wow. That was a good shot. I might be able to actually duel him in this next round. We'll see. Okay, hold on. Anyways. Yeah, they're doing renovations on my apartment, um, and I happen to live on the top floor, and they're they're tearing down the roof and all that good stuff to make, make us our place a safer place to live. So, oh, that's kind of nice, though. It's a pain in the butt. It can get kind of noisy. I'm not going to use these ships, so I might as well shoot. Oh, he's going right after me. All right. Fair enough. Okay, I'm going to hold on the Y button here. Just let the battle continue. Man, my fleets are taking some crew damage, but that's okay. I can refill on my crew when we get to the town. Um, okay, we'll attack. We will indeed challenge him to a duel. All right. I'm gonna thrust real quick. Oh, he carried me. Okay. This guy was giving me... Anyway. Okay. Let's see. I'm going to try a lash, see what that does. Yeah, sure enough, sure enough. Now it blocks. Okay, well this guy isn't too tough. He only has a battle level 14. And we got pretty strong armor and he has a weak sword, so... Eventually he'll uh, he'll block. There we go, there's a good shot. Right back into it. We can just use the same strategy. Block his main attacks. That shouldn't do too much damage. And just keep returning with thrusts, and he should go down eventually. Alright. A block there. Oh, thrust eight. Hopefully this will take care of him. That should do it. Sweet. Got him. Eventually you get to the point in the game where you can one-shot everybody, but yay, we got him. And there was much rejoicing. Yay. Okay. Very good. We destroyed the Turkish fleet. Ooh, 15,000 gold pieces. That's pretty nice. Okay, we don't need any of those. More, most importantly, we definitely need the food and water, because we're, we're running a little low on food. So, I like to balance out my food and water as much as possible um, per ship. Just because when, when you do the auto supply in ports, um, it'll try and balance it out for you. So, it just, it, this just makes it easier. Okay, I'm going to take all this food and water. But unfortunately, that's not enough. So, we're going to get more free food and water by beating up another one of these guys. But someday my country will avenge my feet. Sure, they will. Okay. Now, I'm, I'm not quite full crew yet, so I need to rearrange uh, some of my crew members to make sure that I have 320 so that I can duel here. Um, okay. Oops. Yeah, okay, it doesn't really matter. I just need enough to duel them, and then I can rearrange a little bit later, and I can refill my guys. I can refill my crew when I get back to Massawa. So. Okay, I'm going to take care of Rashid Jabbar real quick. And then I will be right back. Alright, piece of cake. We're back. 
And, uh, okay, I, I'm running a little low. So we're going to assign 200 guys to that. Yeah, I definitely am in some trouble here. I, I actually took one of their ships because I need some crew. and um, But I can deal with that when I get back to Masawa. So, okay, take care of that. All right. Now we're going to power sail up to Masawa. As you can see, the fleets disappeared. They eventually say they're on their way home. But... Oh, there was a big thud. Must have been something weird going on upstairs. Okay, let's go to the cafe, check things out. Door's locked. Can we tell me where Jao is? He's at the palace, but they're still hiding from the Turks. All right. Well, let's go to the palace, which is this building down here. Okay, it's sealed off. There's no back entrance. Finally, we are going to get our revenge on Jao Franco. And there he is. Here we go, folks. It's game time. The climax of the game right here. Too dangerous in the middle of all these enemies. This is her problem. What's been tormenting us the whole time. There we go. Oh, he takes back what he said about us. Wow, so apparently he was not too bad. Okay, here we go. It's go time. Let's ask just one question. Okay, fine. One question before you die. Why do we think Jow's running? Well, very simply. Yeah, your family's a, your family's a bunch of crooks and murderers. That's right. Came from the Franco family. That's right. The Red Cross, the Maltonites. It's very simple. Oh, great. New music. Though I must say, I love this music. But who's this guy? Who is this? Pietro Conti, an adventurer from Genoa. Great. What do, what do, what do you want? Franco's private fleet, right? Okay, tell us the facts. We didn't have a private... What? We didn't have a fleet in April of 1522, but then who attacked us? Okay. Gave his fleet to the Portuguese Royal Navy. So we didn't have... Well, what? well, then who did this to us? What? But who destroyed my brother? Yeah, that's what we want to know. What do you know, Jow? Oh, my gosh. The incident had nothing... So we've been chasing the wrong guy this whole time? Oh, my gosh. Oh, that's so sad. Well, Jow, I don't want your pity. That's right. We don't need any pity from the Portuguese. Man. So... One final look from Jao. We've been chasing the wrong guy this whole time. Oh my gosh. Well, viewers, I don't know what to do now. Well, I do, but if I was playing for the first time, I would have no idea what to do. But I know what I can do in the meantime is I can um, rearrange some of my crew and kind of get myself ready to go. And we might as well go back to Europe and figure this thing out. So I'm going to rearrange some of my crew, uh, get everything good to go, and I'll meet you guys back in Europe. All right, here we are in the port of Suda. We're back in Europe here, viewers. Um, okay, I'm going to see what we got going on up here. Catalina Iranzo, by any chance? Yes, why, well, yes, I am. Ali Vezas is looking for you, a Turkish trader. What would you want with us? Yeah, I've never heard that name before either. Okay, great. He doesn't like cafes, so he wants to meet us at the lodge. Stingy, annoying guy, or stingy, annoying guy, sorry. Okay, we'll go see him. Might as well. The lodge is only a few paces away, so let's go up here and take care of this. Let's see. Where is Ali Vezas? Nope, oh, there he is. Okay. Catalina Renzo, by any chance. And what if we are? Yeah, what do you want? Oh, this is Ali. Okay, so this is Ali, the Turkish trader. So what's your point? Pietro Conti has asked us to find us. Yes, we have met Pietro. He was with Jao in Massawa when we... Well, if, he's, if he wants to speak with us, but he's so busy, why doesn't he go find us? Ugh, sounds lazy to me. He's in Lisbon. Uh-oh. We have to go back to Lisbon? That's not good. Yeah, I don't have good memories of that place either, but... Well, unfortunately, I'm almost out of time, so... But this has just been a crazy turn of events, viewers. We... Found out that Jao's not our enemy, but who is now? We're going to go to Lisbon next time and hopefully get some answers. But uh, I'm almost out of time. So until next time, this is BCS Buster signing off. Take care, y'all.